just being unsolicited followed and monitored by strangers. So, like all this time, I've been saying, oh, you know what? I did not go through the legal system. I haven't been through the the, the um court because I haven't received any court orders. So, so like really, I mean, it, it, it's it's interesting. It's an it's annoying. It is. Just like you see, as you can see, like a lot of people are just unsolicitedly monitoring and following me. And I'm like, you know what? Oh, this is the um, car that I'm on. So since I haven't been through the court system, in which I did not like get any legal documents, like um, a court order, since like a court order is from the courts, and like um, I mean, like I know that I'm being taken seriously. So like um, with the, with every new batch of of unsolicited followers and monitors comes like just cluelessness. But you know what, like the highly skilled have like um, a lot of material to work with. So like, um, I'm, I am like, um, I mean, even though it's hard for me to just not scare um, like the evidence away, I, I mean like, let me just put it to you like this. The more unsolicited followers and monitors disbelieve me, like, and the longer that I am unsolicitedly followed and monitored, then the more material that the highly skilled has to, like, carefully comb, comb through. And, like, really, like, it, it's, it's, it, it's amazing because like I see like the, the, the foundation of of like um of like why I'm not being being believed because at one point at an emergency um shelter I actually saw some artwork that was made to play tricks on your eyes. And like, um, like I didn't get a chance to closely observe it. And I, I told the staff personnel there who like just immediately just sent me to, um, not let me back up. Like I, when I told the personnel Basically, they in, they they immediately like um, took notes of it and then like used that as a foundation to like why they sent me to uh, um to um to um what's that called to like a crazy house like CPAC. So like it so it is just crazy. I haven't gone through any um any like courts or or lawyers or what have you, but yet but yet I'm like treated as a criminal. So um since I haven't received any since I haven't received any court order and like like um those things like the court order comes from the court, then of course, like those who, who like work the courts are going to like see like why haven't I gone through your system. So I haven't received any legal documents. I've just been falsely reported on. And 
I'm still continuing my online documentary series and this reminds me like I really do warn like those who text um, people I really do like warn people who text um, who send text messages about me to whomever to make sure that their text messages of me stay hidden because like I don't think anyone would want to experience like um, any reaction from the courts because it because like since I'm not in their system meaning like no part of me has been has gone through their system then there's no reason for strangers to unsolicitedly monitor and follow me. There's none. But you know what, since like that incident at that emergency shelter has people questioning my mental um, well-being or my mental status, then they're just going to continue to like leave um, a lot of evidence for like the courts to actually look through because like really a reaction from the courts can come in any form so if they want to like continue to mess with them then okay I hope they have like like a good explanation like for like this kind of treatment because I haven't been told anything but it does make sense so so like for those who are like um legally crazy like it, it is it, it does make sense for a third person to actually do stuff on their behalf but the thing is no like no no legally crazy person will ever go through an interrogation because of their mental status so like really like i'm like i'm like either either i'm crazy or i'm a criminal because i can't be both i i can't be both so like really like enough is enough and like like I I already have over a thousand views on my online documentary series because it's been going on for a while now and it's obvious that 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 those who have been unsolicitedly monitoring and following me while analyzing my mental health illness or what have you like that's been on the report that's what like they're just leaving more and more evidence for like they're highly skilled to like um to like carefully look at so like really they can either um be um as specific as as ever when it comes to me or they can just um i don't even know because like the highly skilled is like they are the highly skilled so and on top of that comes like the reaction from the courts in finding out or it or 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 just being aware that i've never been through their system so like, let me see, let me see the cause and effect of that. No, do that again, look at your wrist again. Cause like really, you're, um, you're like um, teaching like my, my virtual audience a lot. And this hasn't been, been done like, um, like once before, meaning you're not the first person to do it. So do that again, cause really, that like this just shows that I'm really on this train. So that reminds me. Let me show them these people that I'm 
that my phone is really being unsoliciting monitored. Cause like really, like that incident that I was a part of was um was um done in 2020. This is now 2023, and yet this kind of foolishness, like the weird phrases, is still on my phone. So. Until next time in the next clip.